Hi everyone, Lori Marie, mixed media artist here in Vallejo, California on this rainy Sunday afternoon. Um, we have come so far on the Celerity Collage and so I want to tell you what's next. Everybody's dying to know what's next. So we're going to jump right to the table and I will show you what we've done together and what comes next. Okay? All right, see you on the table. Okie doke, here we go. So our first video was creating the background with a piece of scrapbook paper and some fabric and then the circles and the dots. And then we went in with the stabilo and darkened some of the edges on the circles and the dots. Okay, so we got that done. And then we went to the fun with the watercolors. So we did the watercolor paper with the stamps, the bubble wrap, the tape, and the foil. Okay. And then we cut our delicious arcs. I have just a few here. So you cut your arcs. Yum, 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 yummy. And then we went, we cut our background into four pieces so we could build the arcs onto each individual collage piece. So here I have my four pieces that were cut. I worked on them independent of one another and I put some arcs on here. I made some wavy ones and some straight ones out of the three sheets of the watercolor paper that we played with. All right, so I made the arcs out of the three colors. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take it to my sewing machine and I'm going to do some stitching on it. I've chosen three colors to play with. A blue, a wine, and a rust. So these are the three colors that I'm going to be playing with on my sewing machine. So I'm going to take this over there, I'm going to sew on it, and then I'll bring it back and show you the, what we can do to uh, embellish it just a little bit more, okay? See you in a few. Okie doke, welcome back. So here's our celerity piece. I've done some stitching on it. I used the colors that I showed you, except I replaced the light blue with the golden color. It showed up better. So I have the kind of wine color going around in circles here. I just went along the, the arcs. And then with the rust color, I kind of did a zigzag in between just some of the rows, like this. In between some of the arcs. And then with the golden color, I just went to the center and then out like a sunburst. Okay, so you can kind of see that. I did go around some of the edges with the stabilo. So once again, it's the Stabilo 8046 that I use. And that you go along the edge of the arc, a little bit of spit on your finger, or dip your finger into the water, whichever works best for you, and just go around and low light some of the, the arcs. Just brings them, makes them pop a little bit more. So it's very fun. So go around and do that. The next little fun thing that I have to show you is with glue dots, glue dots, available at your craft store. I imagine Target or anything like that would have them now. And you take the glue dots, pick a space that needs some energy, mm. we'll go here and just push your glue dots down. I have three glue dots, one, two, and three. And then the printer foil that you can get at a local printer. You take that, that's the printer foil, or they have it at the craft store. I believe it's called transfer foil. And you put it shiny side up on top of your glue dots. One, two, three. Voila. Is that not just the coolest thing ever? So I'm going to just go around and put one here and there. There's a glue dot there. Put the printer foil down, pull it up, and I've got some bling, bling, bling. Looks pretty gosh darn good. I'll put some up in here. One, two, 
three. Place her foil down. One, two, three. Okay, so I'll, <laughs> let me just put a couple more down and I'll let you guys go. Beautiful. I might put some more over in here in your absence. But there it is, your celerity collage. Hopefully you had fun doing this. Um, I do have a couple that I worked on. This I, I think I told you that I lost one of the background quarters. So I was like, oh my goodness. So what did I do? I made this. Um, this is the background quarter. I went ahead and cut that into quarters. And then I used fabric for the arcs, which was kind of fun. Then I put some beads on it. Still the stabilo in some of the areas. Gold dots, white dots, white, just white paint dots. So that's something else you can do. It's very fun. All right, once again, thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Uh, our audience is growing, 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 which I'm excited about. So thanks for joining me. Thanks for the playtime.